the same book over and over, ate infrequently, and developed quite. De I wrote the book. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Devoted quite a bit of my abundant free time to thinking about death. Whenever you read a cancer booklet or website or whatever, they always list depression among the side effects of cancer. But in fact, depression is not a side effect of cancer. Depression is a side effect of dying. Cancer is also a side effect of dying. Almost everything is really side note, not in the novel. A lot of people have taken issue with that line and been like, cancer isn't a side effect of dying. Well, that's, they're wrong, I'm right. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to put too fine a point on it, but we know that cancer is a side effect of dying because cancer wouldn't exist if it weren't for mitosis, which wouldn't be necessary if it weren't for cell death. Um, and yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we know for, we know for <laughs> So she took me to see my regular Dr. Jim, who agreed that I was veritably swimming in a paralyzing and totally clinical depression, and that therefore my meds should be adjusted and also I should attend a weekly support group. The support group featured a rotating cast of characters in various states of tumor-driven unwellness. Why did the cast rotate? A side effect of dying. The support group, of course, was depressing as hell. It met every Wednesday in a basement of a stone-walled Episcopal church shaped like a cross. in London. I think so. I'm not positive. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh, good. <laughs> I'll see you there then, hopefully. Thank you. Bye. Bye. 